Well, I got your headlines right off the top. Cold tonight, a few flurries ahead, and a seasonable seven day with an asterisk. So I'll show you what that looks like in the seven day. Let's take a look at the time lapse here. We had another day with not too many clouds. So let's take a look at this beautiful sunset. You're seeing the blues, but as the sun gets to the horizon, look at how those changes, the colors change to the golden and then the pinks as it heads to the horizon. Taking a look at the temperatures today, folks, we finally made it above the average mark being at 32. We are at 37 and overnight was cold, but we'll catch up for those overnight lows as well. Take a look at these temperatures right now. You're anywhere between the 20s to the 30s. You see those long lines? It's still a bit breezy out there, so it is having an impact on your winds. Check it out. You're seeing anywhere between the single digits to the 20s, going from the 20s to the 30s. So it's feeling a bit more cool than what those thermometers read. You're taking a look at 7 Super Doppler. You're seeing the clouds there. It's helping to insulate some of that heat that we saw from the sunshine. It's going to be breezy tomorrow. Well, not so much tomorrow. You're seeing the lighter winds, but the clouds are on the increase as those snow showers make their way in. These are a bit flurries. They'll be in the afternoon and to the overnight. But really, Tuesday morning, you're looking at the high traffic commute areas. You're going to want to take a little extra time for that morning commute because it's going to be a little impacted by that snow. And then you see it head off in the afternoon. The winds change coming from the west. It's a bit breezy, and you're seeing it really just have that long fetch, making some pesky lake effect for the north country. Not a problem for us. As you go into the overnight, Tuesday into Wednesday, it's breezy again. The clouds are on the increase, and you see some showers coming in, some of those being those wintry showers on the uh, lower elevations and snow in the higher elevations. 22 tonight. I told you the overnight lows were going to be better than what we saw last night, seeing 9 degrees for last night. Tomorrow, you're seeing those temperatures in the 30s. We went from a mostly sunny and seasonable Sunday to a mostly cloudy Monday. Still seasonable. Take a look at that seven day, seasonable, and then Tuesday, those temperatures take a temporary tumble. I'll try to say that five times fast. Into the 20s, another T there. As you go into Wednesday, you'll be back in the 30s with some PM snow showers. And really, as you head throughout the rest of that seven day, you're seeing more chances for snow showers pretty much every day in that seven day, but it's not a washout when it comes to the snow or whiteout or however you want to say it. And then those temperatures finally dipping back down to the 20s and the teens as you get to the end of that 70.